subscribe to Jammers on Tour. Hi there guys, welcome back to the episode of Jana's On Tour. It is the 22nd of January 2023 and it is another big match day. Plymouth Argyle versus Cheltenham Town at Home Park. Sold out Home Park once again. It's going to be a big one, big atmosphere. Everyone anticipating seeing the new sign-ins today, such as Ben Wayne, uh, Atete, etc. Playing um, for, in front of the Home Park crowd for the first time, so it should be um, exciting. Obviously, we're coming back off, coming off the back of a good draw at Ipswich, 1-1. Mumba scoring in the uh, 91st minute really sets us up nicely for today. Top of the league, uh, looking to gain three more points. I think Cheltenham are going to come and try and frustrate us. Obviously, we just beat them 1-0 at their place. But we should have enough quality in my eyes to see the job through today. And I'm actually going to go for a big win today. I think we can win 4 or 5 nil. I'm going to go for it today. I think I'm probably going to come and bite me in the bum, but I think we can try and just get our goal difference up today and do a great job. So 4 or 5 nil. Alfie May is the one to look out for for them. Um, you know, good goal scorer. If anyone's going to threaten us, it will be him. So, guys, I am with the good, the man himself, Joe O'Hara Child. Hello. The Totnes Janna. The Totnes Janna, yeah. We'll go for that. I'm expecting a win. Yeah. Definitely. It's only Cheltenham, isn't it? Oh, uh, there's Cheltenham fans maybe watching this. <laughs> We've got a cater for I'm all. not taking it back. Yeah, 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 I'm not taking it back. Fine, that's fine. A win's uh, a win. So, debut on Janna's on, on tour, Joe? I think it is, isn't it? It is, I think. But we been to, we've been to quite a few though. But before I started vlogging, we've we've done Exeter away together, haven't yeah. we? Pompey it's my away. My first time at Argyle in four years, five years. Quite a few years. So I said to put on the show for you. A long time. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, no, that's going to be good. So uh, yeah, we're going to head up there now. See Rich selling the programs, and um, hopefully we will get some good action today. And um, it will be a three points that we can all celebrate at the end of the day. So come on, your greens. Come on, your greens. Let's go. Back at the theatre of the Greens, Joe, how's it feeling? Good, the Greens. Oh, yes. Alright, with the man Rich Francis. How you doing, Rich? Uh, not bad, everyone. How are you? Good. How are everyone? Yeah, good to see you. My first Saturday since August, eh? I unbelievable. Know. It's unbelievable, yeah. isn't it? Luckily, there's been a lot of midweek games, though. Obviously, then, big draw last weekend at Ipswich. Vital that we got that point, wasn't it, in the end? Better. I don't know. Three points in my eyes. It, it did feel like it, but now on to today. A game we should have won, but you never know. Now, nah, Delta and them are a very funny team. Me and my yeah. dad watched it on Boxing Day on Arlo TV. Yeah. Not much happened no. in them. But at Home Park, you would expect big pitch today. Hopefully, we could uh, we'll get that win. I bet the Arlo was the best team at, as well. Obviously, up in our temple at home. Yeah, yeah, team. that's it. And I, I went for a big win today. I put 4 5 nil. So, what, <laughs> you, what are you going for, Rich? I think they made a solid 2 nil. 2 nil, being a bit more realistic with that one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, let's hope we, uh, all like Glenn said earlier, Another uh, follower of the channel, he said a win is just what we need, three points. Just keep the better off. Yeah. And also getting to see all the new signings today at home first time, going to be exciting, eh? Oh, definitely. But yeah. I hope we open the award number one or, or some might miss out. With yeah. The team we got now, we got a big job now, so it's fair to miss out. Yeah, but it's a good, good problem to have, eh? Big problem, yeah. yeah. Well, we'll see you at halftime, Rich. Definitely. And let's hopefully we'll be uh, having a, talking about a positive half. Yeah, hopefully. Okay, come to Greens. Greens. Let's go. Back with Drew C on the channel. It's been a while, Drew. Say, how you doing, man? Good. Yeah, very good. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. So you were at Ipswich last weekend. Tell us about that one. Yeah. Well, that moment alone in the yeah. 95 minutes. Yeah. Trip. I, I bet it was. Yeah. I bet it was. Point. Yeah. yeah. Everyone felt the significance. Of that. Felt like a win in a way. It did. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I guess. Um, yeah. Long trip, but that that made it worth it. That goal. Yeah. Stayed up there for the weekend as well. Yeah. Kind of, kind of bit yeah. Bit oh, amazing. Good. Yeah, Sounds good. Atmosphere was. Not great, really, from the home perspective. Yeah. Um, I thought it was quite an even game. Both yeah. teams had chances. Yeah. Um, and then you're thinking sort of our, a one nil narrow defeat, a bit of a blow. Yeah. But yeah, that number. Goes. Yeah. Big, big one. And then obviously uh, Sheffield Wednesday away next, it's huge. Massive. But obviously before that today, a game we would expect to win. Um, new signings on show today as well. Yeah. What very, is, yeah. It's very hard to pick the start of eleven, doesn't it? It is. Yeah. So much depth in that yeah. It's a good problem to have. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. So what are you sort of going for then? Uh, I think I'm going to go for a three one win. A three one win. Yeah. 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 You say. That Alfie May is probably the threat for them. Yeah, I think you can just yeah. keep hold of him because he'll yeah. be on the last man, won't he? And yeah. I think our defence is secure enough, hopefully, for the cap. That's it. We should have enough quality to yeah. get through. It'd be nice to see one of the new players get a goal too hopefully. today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd like to see Wayne start, really. I think he's, he's yeah. doing a great sharpness and yeah. I think I hardly missed last week. I know, yeah, yeah, yeah. But that's it. Well, hopefully now that we've got a bigger squad that will help us see it through. Obviously, what happened last season was we weren't, didn't have a big enough squad. Yeah, that's it. That's it. All right, then, well, let's hope we celebrate the three points at the end of the day. Have a good one, Drew C. Thank you very much.
on the shot. to Cheltenham Town 1. Okay, it's been a very tight affair in that end of that second half. I thought we really dominated them to start the first half. Two quick goals, Scar and Hardy, but I think we once that second goal went in a bit complacent and um, yeah, they sort of came into it a little bit. So I think second half, job's not done yet, is it Rich? Definitely not, no. We have two or three miles there. Now, I think yeah. I've been made to do that one on one, but it's been bored. Yeah. But Matt Jones is always German. You can see it with German. Too many people. Yeah, you can. Broom's been good, hasn't he? It's been a while. And Jordan is the best passer. It has, it has. I've been very impressed with Tyreek Bright down that side. Yeah, and that many tips so far. Yeah, a lot of pace can beat a person. Uh, he's had a couple of efforts, too. Yeah, definitely. In, jo in the fat floor, that yeah. little white right bit. Not up to it yet, so no. far. not how far I thought it would be. Who would you like to see second half? Come on, anyone? Ben Wayne. Ben Wayne, nice to see him. Uh, apparently, no Anna Hawk, one, no, uh, Anna and um, Adam Adele, not no. even on the bench today. Oh, something's good, maybe they're ill, something. Yeah. Yeah, here he is, look, Sean Hi. How are you finding it so far, Sean? Yeah, fine, okay. Good to get two and a but let them in a bit. Six, eight, 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 one, if that's you, you yeah, just got one of those seven days. Six, eight, 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 e
Back in the car after massive win today, Plymouth Argyle 4, Chutland Town 2. We ground it out, don't we, Rich? We done it out and um, yeah. it was brilliant to win the map what we needed to it do. It was. I said 4 at the start of the day, I said 4-0. <laughs> so I was partly there, just didn't give uh, Chutland enough credit there. But I thought they actually, Chutland looked quite dangerous at times. We did we did sort of let them in ourselves, I think, like you said, Scar, um, yeah, for the second. Dar, I thought Dar sort yeah. of done something, he did let Alfie May run in on it. Yeah, he but we know that first. Alfie May was going to be dangerous, don't we? We did, yeah. No, yeah. yeah, good to see Wright get his first goal for us, obviously against his former club. So overall, really, really good day, and it helps that obviously Ipswich lost 2-1 at Oxford massive, as well. Massive, massive. Massive for us, so we're 10 points clear of them, obviously they've got a game in hand, but at the end of the day, we keep winning our games, and that's the most important thing, so... Top of the league still, really, really going strong. And um, we've got two weeks off now until probably one of the biggest games of the season, Sheffield Wednesday away. It's going to be massive, isn't it, Rich? Massive, massive. But if we don't point out Sheffield Wednesday, it feel like take a that. victory. Take that. And Joe, enjoyed your return to Home Park? Yeah, man, it was great. Thanks for having me and uh, it was good to beat Cheltenham. No yeah. problem, and, and I told you we beat Cheltenham. You did. You said it. You you, you did tell those Cheltenham fans we would win. Cheltenham, come at me. You know. <laughs> see you. See you in a few weeks for the Papa John's trophy. <laughs> see you in a few weeks, you slags. <laughs> so, guys, thank you very much for tuning in today. Um, we will be back for the um, Pompey Pompey game, which is going to be in three weeks' time. Yeah. So we'll be vlogging that one. I'll be back for that one as well, and then on to Cheltenham again. Papa John's trophy. We're not at Wembley yet. If they play like that, are we? Definitely not. A lot of fans already put in tickets for it. In my yeah. eyes, with what we saw today, it's going to be a tough game. Uh, we did not underestimate Tilton and Tampa by one minute. We not, not shouldn't underestimate them. Not at all. All right, guys. Well, thank you very much for tuning in. Got most of the goals on the camera, so uh, please like, comment, subscribe if you can. Hope you're enjoying the vlogs. We'll see you in a few weeks' time for another big Dockyard Derby, Plymouth Argyle Portsmouth. Come on, you guys!